How to find a cheap place to stay in San Francisco. San Francisco is the commercial center of Northern California and can be an expensive place to visit. If you want to stay in San Francisco but are on a limited budget, there are ways you can get free or cheap accommodations. There are many websites, like Airbnb and Hostelworld.com, that offer reservations for affordable rooms. If you're really strapped for cash, you can try to stay with a friend, camp out, or use a hospitality exchange like Couchsurfing to stay somewhere for free. Getting discounted rooms. Compare room rates on a variety of booking sites. Search for hotels or motels on a variety of different booking sites to find the best deal. If you find a room that you want to stay in, look it up on competitor websites and see if you can get a better deal. Popular websites to use include Booking.com, Priceline, Hotwire, Orbitz, and Expedia. Popular websites to use include Booking.com, Priceline, Hotwire, Orbitz, and Expedia. Use discount websites to find deals. Sites like Living Social Escapes and Groupon Getaways sometimes have discounts on places to stay in San Francisco. After looking at the traditional accommodation websites, take a look at these discount sites to see if you can find any good deals. Read the fine print and take note of additional fees before finalizing your reservation. Read the fine print and take note of additional fees before finalizing your reservation. Call the hotel or motel directly instead of booking online. Ask the hotel if they have any deals or promotions on rooms. Most hotel and motel chains will match a price that you found online. If the rooms they offer are more expensive than what you found online, ask them if they will match the price. Hotels and motels are most likely to offer deals on non-peak seasons and on weekdays. Non-peak seasons are November through April while peak seasons are May through October. Hotels and motels are most likely to offer deals on non-peak seasons and on weekdays. Non-peak seasons are November through April while peak seasons are May through October. Purchase someone else's reservation if you don't mind last-minute booking. Sites like Rumor allow people to sell room reservations that they can no longer fulfill. Typically, these cancellations are made due to last-minute travel changes. Though you can find high-quality rooms for cheap using this method, you might be cutting it close when you book your room. Stay at a hostel instead of a hotel or motel. Hostels are like hotels or motels but are cheaper and have shared living and cooking areas. Popular hostels in San Francisco include High San Francisco, USA Hostels San Francisco, and Amsterdam Hostel. A night's stay typically ranges from $30 to $100 USD. Find hostels in San Francisco on websites like Hostelworld.com and USA Hostels. Find hostels in San Francisco on websites like Hostelworld.com and USA Hostels. Book your room two months in advance to save money. Booking last minute is more expensive than getting your room in advance. Try to plan out your trip and book your accommodations two months in advance to avoid peak booking fees and overpriced rooms. Booking further than two months in advance won't typically save you more money. Booking further than two months in advance won't typically save you more money. Consider staying outside of San Francisco to find cheaper accommodations. If you can't find cheap accommodations in San Francisco, consider staying right outside of the city. Use Bay Area Rapid Transit, or BART, to cheaply travel from outside of the city into San Francisco. You can use tools like Google Maps to plot your trip before you leave. Affordable towns outside of San Francisco include Oakland and Berkeley. Taking the BART from Oakland to San Francisco costs under $3 USD. Once in the city, use public transportation like Muni buses or the Metro train to save money. Tay 8. Greater than affordable towns outside of San Francisco include Oakland and Berkeley. Taking the BART from Oakland to San Francisco costs under $3 USD. Once in the city, use public transportation like Muni buses or the Metro train to save money.